cool, cool, cool. Clear, 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 clear. <laughs> Justin, we are doing it, man. That was awesome. The two biggest distractions in my life other than eat, sleep, and drink is gasoline and gravity. <laughs> I'm an ambassador for a lot of different companies. I'm a Hall of Fame snow skier. I grew up skiing and climbing, and I still ski several hundred days a year. I was known as the guy with a mohawk that everybody was scared of and hated. <laughs> uh, trying to be on the U.S. ski team, you had to be a Ken doll, and I wasn't no Ken doll. I didn't live like no Ken doll. I didn't look like no Ken doll and I didn't want to compete like one. I lived pretty hard, I skied pretty fast, and uh, my skis were my wings and I let them fly. I'm all over the internet, trust me. <laughs> I've been recognized as a four founder of Extreme Sports way before the X Games became popular. Some of my early helmet camera footage has gone on to, you know, now we call them GoPros. My first helmet camera was 16 pounds. Had a World War II aircraft camera on one side and a giant battery on the other, and it was a heavy SOB, but I took some nice pictures. It's pretty funny to hear, you know, people, oh my gosh, you're the dude that, like, started it all. My other passion, though, has always been, and I think it comes from my grandparents, uh, I used to, you know, hang out with Grandpa on the ranch, and so I've always kind of been a mechanic also. My grandpa was a depressionist, and he worked on things. You don't buy anything you can fix. So I learned a lot of learned a lot about fixing things, whether it was a tractor or a starter in your pickup truck or whatever. I've never had a new car. I've always had junk that I bought that I needed to fix, or I'm gonna get this running. Wait, you see when I'm done with this thing. And then that led into, you know, building hot rods, you wanna make things faster, built a lot of fast boats. Then that got me into racing, and then I love stock cars, so I started building bomber, racing bombers, and then I raced modifieds, and then I did a bunch of Baja racing. I've had the pleasure of racing the Dakar Rally. I've kind of been a jack all trades when it comes down to motorsports and mechanics surrounding motorsports. <laughs> Have you seen the thing? <laughs> She's bowling right now, baby. She is bowling. I am so happy that I've had some of the lesser vehicles up on top of the hill, and everybody's scratching their heads going, what just happened, man? Pete's over there going, that thing's a pile of junk. What it but the dude? <laughs> yeah, buddy! <laughs> I tell people all the time, don't ever let anybody tell you you can't do what you think you can. <laughs> it might be hard, uh, but uh, you might, might surprise them. You won't surprise yourself. You knew you were going to do it. <laughs> boom, boom, boom!